morning guys and welcome back to making it with the Matthews. So I know we are actually heading out on another trip. So we're heading to St. Thomas guys. So come with us. Let's go for a ride. Life is a marathon, a journey that we're always on. To the floor, hit the road, see everything under the sun. Whoa. Keep on running, pick up the pace, won't come naturally. Gotta keep on running, hard work pays eventually. Keep up the pace. Take a moment to cool down, then get back on. Behind the scenes content creation, you guys. We came to the airport super early so we could catch some content. And yeah, this one's gonna be nice. Wait. And we skip to the good part. You've arrived at your destination. <laughs> I'ma hit this drink up like it's my last. Last, last. Play it up like it's my last. Para abrochar su cinturón, insierte la pieza plana de metal dentro de la hebilla y jale el extremo de la correa hasta que quede bien ajustado. Para desabrochar, solo levanta la tapa de la hebilla. Por favor, mantenga su cinturón de seguridad bien abrochado y visible a la tripulación en todo momento, incluso cuando la señal esté apagada. Hello guys, welcome back to Making It with the Matthews. If you're new here, I'm Melissa and on the camera is Travis and today we're joining you in beautiful St. Thomas. We just got off the plane, beautiful weather, the vibes are right. We're waiting for our shot. Oh, thank you. There's a coconut. I love coconut. So this is the USDI ambassador and we're having our coconut rum shot, Kujan rum. That was good. Mm -hmm. So this one is a coconut cruisian, but they have other flavors. Something up, hubby likes um, the darker cruisian mixed with Coke. So Coke. that's what we're gonna have. And guys, all of this you can do as soon as you step foot off the airplane. 
Let's just go have some fun. Mm -hmm. Cool. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They get some nice Life is a marathon. The journey is a long one. Life is a marathon. The journey that we're always on. Life is a marathon. To the floor, hit the road, see everything under the sun. Whoa. Keep on running, pick up the pace, won't come naturally. Gotta keep on running, hard work pays eventually. Keep up the pace. Take a moment to cool down, then get back on your feet. Gotta keep on running, heading towards. If you want, you can even go outside, meet with a lot of local taxi guys. How you doing, brother? Who are you waiting for me? I don't know. Are you this person? I could be. Depends where we going. <laughs> it depends where we going. I could be that person. So this your first time here? I'm my from St. Thomas man. Oh, see that? Yeah, I'm from St. Thomas man. <laughs> I just coming home. Welcome back home. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Guys, you never have to wait for bags. Well, we've had to. No, we didn't have to. I was catching it. So guys, yeah, we just landed, got our bags, got something to drink. I don't want to say it took less than 30 minutes, you know? I mean, granted, it's a very slow time. We came in today on the airport, so that's probably why. Usually it's not this quick, even though it's pretty speedy. It's one of the things I like about coming into this airport right here. You come in, you don't really have to interact with anybody else. You get off the plane, you're on the tarmac, you walk straight into the baggage claim. They got free shots waiting for you, or it's a bar that you could buy the drink of your liking. And you just go pick up your bags, walk straight out. You either have somebody waiting on you, or you catch a taxi, or you can walk out to the main strip right here and catch a safari or a bus to get where you're going. So this is what you do when you're traveling into St. Thomas. Just wanted to highlight and show you guys what's going on. So come on, travel with us. The Matthews in St. Thomas, doing it. All right, guys. So. My mom and dad was trying to surprise us and they got miscommunication on who exactly was going to show up. So now we got a little bit of wait. But that's one of the good things about being on this airport. If you're stuck, stranded or delayed, you don't have to worry about eating food on the airport where we know things are a little bit pricey. Nice little stroll to the edge of the airport and you catch one of our restaurants, which you should have previously seen in the taste of the island video it's called Ashley's It's located directly on the airport well not inside where you park but on the outside strip so that's what we walk into right now to let you guys see so yeah you'll pass it on the way in when you enter in the airport it will be on your left hand side before you come through the little turnstiles and if you're walking back out you would walk to the very far end and it's right on your left hand side so come on and let's go see what's going on at Ashley's and what they got on the menu today. Yes, yeah, I want to come. Okay, nice. That's it? Yeah. You ain't hot in that jacket? Yes. It's hot. Nice and fresh. Oh, look, I'm saying this. Taste the feeling of St. Thomas. Uh -huh. Taste the feeling of St. Thomas. I like it. Yeah, guys, so we're waiting for Papa Patty. I say Patty, they say Patty. It is spelled differently. Right? <laughs> $18. $18. That's the money, man, right there. Better be here at the camera. That's awesome. Wow. Keep on 
running, pick up the pace, don't come naturally. Gotta keep on running, hard work pays eventually. My mom, mama just came to pick us up. Does the engine shut off when you, yeah. when you, yeah, yeah, so. That's why she's doing that vibration. Mm -hmm. What's baby happening? It make me, I'm um, thinking I must have been mm -hmm. I said, hey, hey, do you feel the way that I do? I said, hey, hey. do you feel the way that I do? I said, hey, hey. do you feel the way that I do? I said, hey, do you feel the way that I do? So we're currently on the beach. We just left the airport. And one of our first things that we have to do, and you should probably do, when you come to St. Thomas, just pull over, rent a car, taxi, whatever. Kick off the shoes. Do you feel the way that I do? All right, guys, so you see it. You get the emeralds. You got to dip your foot in the beach, OK? Get off the airport. We're right across from the airport. Yeah, we try to make it a tradition. As soon as we get here, you know, the first thing we do is embrace the island by dipping our foot in the water. I'm a private, I don't have no organization. Yeah. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Yes. Yeah. Okay, then I'll uh, we'll see you later then. It ain't windy today, mommy. It windy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> of course the wind gonna blow every day, but it ain't windy. It don't feel like it. I mean, used to be basketball shoes at one point, so. Really? Yeah, that was the first basketball shoes. Called Chuck Chuck Taylor, the guy who made him popular. Okay, she, she, she was watching you then. She should go check the schedule. check the schedule. Yeah, I think so too. Afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. You want pumpkins? The pine, them look just like a Jamaica pine. Natural. Are oh, you want me to? Yes, ma'am. Four gallons, Yeah, any more? Mm. I'll just blend it. Just oh, yeah, for what? Just spice up? Just blend it with the ginger and banana. Miss. Huh? You know what to get? No. Oh, she's gonna. Um, Got on. Got on. Okay. Yeah, we can use some walks for me. <laughs> Coconut, right? This stuff. For me, I want one of those meat. The meat, the The coconut jelly. I want coconut jelly. Thank you. Coconut jelly. We already, um, you know, have to stop for some fruits. We're getting coconut jelly. So as you can see, we have the guys that cooking up, cutting up the coconuts for us, and we're getting um, two. 
gallon of coconut water, which probably is like 10 coconuts, and the jelly. And I'm about to devour that. And I think we got some banana and papaya. And the cost of that is about well, $100. But it's worth it to have. Just got uh, my coconut and jelly I just hear from all that coconut water we just ordered. So thank you. Give me It's been a long